The Heart of Bruce and Melrose Abbey by Felicity Hammonds. Heart that didst press forward still, where the trumpets now ring shrill, where the nightly swords were crossing and the plums like sea foam tossing, laid off a charging sphere, fiery heart, and lies for here. May this ne'er spot the nurn, aught that so could beat and burn. Heart that laughs the clarion's blast, silent is thy place at last. Silent, save an early bird sings where once the mass was heard. Silent, save when breezes moan, comes for flowers of fretted stone. And the wild rose waves around thee, and the long dark grass hath bound thee. Sleepst thou, as the swain might sleep in his nameless velody? Now, brave heart, thou cold and lone, kingly power is yet thine own. Feel I not thy spirit brood over whispering solitude? Loud one high fort of thee, fast they rise, the bold are free, sweeping past the lowly bed of the mute, yet stately tree. Shedding the pale armor's light forth upon the breathless night, bending every warlike plum in the prayer our saintly too. Is the noble Douglas nigh armed to follow thee or die? Now, true heart, as thou would have won, pass thou to the barrier's front, with the banner spears gleaming and the battle's red wine streaming, till the pain and quail before thee, till the cross wave proudly o'er thee. Dreams, the falling of a leaf, wins me from the splendors brief. Dreams, yet bright ones, scorn them not. Though it seeks to a holy spot, nor admits its lone domain, call the faith in relics vain.